Before the action replay and game shark, the most popular way to bend the rules in a video game was via cheat codes. By entering a certain phrase, passcode, or sequence of button presses at a specific point in the game, you'd suddenly find your playing experience to be very different indeed. More often than not, for the better. I'm Jess from What Culture, and today we're getting into 10 most famous video game cheat codes. Number 10. Help You So Be One Star Wars Dark Forces series. The Dark Forces series represents some of gaming's best adaptations of the epic Star Wars universe. Starting as a Duke Nukem-esque first-person shooter and gradually evolving into a wide-open force-wielding slash fest, the classic franchise is as well known for its addictive gameplay as it is for its legendary line of cheat codes. To access these cheats, you first need to type in the code Help You So Be One. After that, the sky's the limit, with literally dozens of codes at your disposal. There's God for God Mode, of course, and Give All, which, well, will give you it all. Weapons, health, ammo, you name it. From Dark Forces 2 onward, Force Powers and Lightsaber Combat come into play, which adds a whole heap more on the cheat codes front. You can instantly max out your Force capacity, learn new saber fighting styles before officially unlocking them, hell, you can even change the color of your lightsaber. Number 9. Instant Mike Tyson Fight Mike Tyson's Punch-Out! 1987 if you've only ever heard one thing about the original 1987 Punch-Out, it's probably safe to assume that it's the fact that the final boss, Mike Tyson himself, is damn hard. Damn hard. Not only that, but because he's the last boss, dying to him and receiving a game over will require you to play through the whole game again, just to have another crack at him. If Tyson himself didn't make you rage quit, then this unforgiving slog will do it every time. So imagine if there was a way to skip all that and plonk yourself straight back into the ring with your arch nemesis. Too good to be true, you say? Well, it's not. Punch-Out features many, many cheats indeed, but if you want to beat the game and still feel like you've achieved something, this code is absolutely the one for you. Simply type in 07-373-5963 on the menu screen and you'll suddenly be launched right back into the match as if nothing ever happened. And while you've still got a hell of a fight ahead of you, at least now your previous opponents aren't going to get up again every time you lose. Number 8. Debug Mode – Sonic the Hedgehog it's one thing to be able to freely skip between levels in a fast-paced and wickedly hard 90s platformer, but given the choice, wouldn't you rather float through these levels at your own speed with the freedom to transform yourself into all sorts of objects along the way? Well, Sonic the Hedgehog gives you both, but the latter is obviously far more satisfying. The instructions to activate this little trick differ depending on which console you're playing the game on but all methods involve a lengthy sequence of button prompts on the title screen. If done properly, you'll then be pretty much free to do whatever you like. In debug mode, you can fly around unrestricted, turn into various enemies and game assets such as checkpoint barriers and power-ups, and even duplicate them to create weird little pictures all over your new playground. What's more, the 10 minute time limit no longer applies, so feel free to zip around like this to your heart's content. Number seven, there is no cow level, StarCraft. Blizzard are nothing if not self-aware, or at least they were in their early days. Their critically acclaimed genre pioneer Diablo is the source of a phenomenon that's been perpetuated in the company's games ever since, as a running joke among developers and fans alike. Rumor had it that by clicking enough times on one of the cows around the town of Tristram, the player would be transported to a secret cow level, hidden away as an easter egg within the game. This rumor turned out to be false, but Blizzard clearly got a kick out of it and decided to carry the joke on. 1998 StarCraft, the cynically Christianed Warcraft in Space, was released a year after Diablo and features a cheat code that not only bags you an instant victory in the game itself, but also puts to rest that infamous theory that fans had yearned to find the answer to. There is no cow level. And while that may have been true at the time, Diablo 2 does indeed finally give us that secret cow level we'd all been dying to see. It's exactly what it says on the tin, too. A level full of cows with halberds. I don't know what we expected. Number 6. Infinite Money – The Sims Series They say money is the root of all evil, but thankfully that only applies in real life. In The Sims, you can't get enough of that glorious virtual moolah as it's used to build your house, fill it with nice stuff, and otherwise keep your helpless family from jumping into the nearest ladderless pool. 
Oh wait, that does sound like real life, doesn't it? From the original 2000 outing all the way to the present day, there are a few crafty ways in which you can totally negate your need for money. And by that I mean you'll end up with so many simoleons you won't know what to do with them. Among these invaluable cheat codes are the words clapacious, rosebud, family funds, and kaching, which can be used basically ad nauseum in each of the main series games. Each of these words will credit 1,000 simoleons to your account. However, if you want the big bucks and this might unlock a memory, just type in motherload and watch as you become 50 grand richer in a split second. Needless to say, cost is no object from that point on. You might even be able to splash out on a ladder for that swimming pool. Pun intended. Number 5. Blood Code – Mortal Kombat Nowadays, Mortal Kombat without lorry loads of blood and gore would be like a great white shark without teeth. Still not terrible as far as their purpose goes, but just not complete. Sadly, that wasn't always the case, as the original Mortal Kombat's level of violence was too much for some distributors to handle, and the blood was censored out. You can only imagine the developers' anger after all the gruesome work they put into those fatalities. But all was not lost, for a beloved cheat code will restore the game to how it was always meant to be, an unholy orgy of blood, bones, and body parts. In the NES version of the game, you'll see a cryptic screen explaining the definitions of the word code, which, as it turns out, is itself a code. Keying in ABACABB -B -B on this screen causes the text to go red, and a final message to appear saying, Now entering combat. Now if you carry on to the main game expecting spines to be ripped from bodies and heads to be smashed open with a single punch, you won't be disappointed. This is one cheat code you're not going to forget anytime soon. Number 4. All Weapons – Tomb Raider If you were getting your hopes up for a topless Lara Croft on this list, perhaps a method of instead obtaining all the weapons in the original Tomb Raider isn't exactly going to blow you away. Sorry. For those content with Lara's pointy woman part staying in her shirt, this cheat code is invaluable at any stage of a playthrough. On the PC version, the way to unlock the All Weapons cheat is as follows. One step forward, one step back, three full turns on the spot, one jump backwards. If done properly, you'll hear a brief clicking sound from a gun, and if you then go into your inventory, all the game's weapons will be right there waiting for you. Its handiness isn't why the cheat is so fondly remembered, however. In both Tomb Raider 2 and Tomb Raider 3, attempting to perform the same moves and cash in on all the weapons will result in Lara exploding in midair. Figure that one out if you can. Number 3. Justin Bailey – Metroid if you see a random name pop up somewhere odd in a video game, you might assume it's probably the name of one of the developers. Not always, my friend. In fact, some random names you find are just that – random. The password system in the original Metroid was coded to accept many different specific combinations of English words. And from that precise software came a bizarre happy accident – Justin Bailey. The phrase doesn't refer to any real-world person, and by typing it into the password menu of the game, the player will spawn a good way through the game as Samus in ordinary clothes, that is, without her classic armor. It's a strange cheat to say the least, but where its notoriety comes in is how baffled the gaming community became trying to figure out just who this Justin Bailey character was. While it turned out to be no one, subsequent games made jesting references to this name, including Catherine, Shadow Complex, and Axiom Verge. They say it was a coincidence, but has the real Justin Bailey simply yet to stand up? Number 2. Id Codes – Doom You can't play Doom without trying out its legendary cheats at least once. The term God Mode, used to describe permanent and unconditional invulnerability of your player character, is often traced back to id Software's first games. And even to this day, the Doom Marine rocks the look way better than most. The code in question is IDDQD, which you can type in freely at any point in the game to rid yourself of that dreadful inconvenience your enemies know as death. Doom Guy's eyes will glow an unblinking, pupilless gold from that point on, signaling clearly to all that stand before you that hell ain't got nothing on you and your trusty shotgun. Another equally popular code is IDKFA, which furnishes you with all the game's weapons, including the BFG, as well as full health and ammo for everything. It also gives you every key card in the level, so if exploration is encroaching on your killing spree, you're now free to skip all that and go back to ripping and tearing like a good little badass. Lord help us if the modern day Doomslayer gets his hands on these codes. Number 1. Konami Code there was never any question as to what the most popular, most well-known and widely used cheat code is out there in the world of video games. 
The Konami code dates back to 1986 in the NES game Gradius, and since then has been used to an equal degree in over a hundred more games across multiple platforms. Up up, down down, left right left right BA. This combination is emblazoned on the minds of all who've used it, and probably a bunch who haven't. And though the code was indeed invented by Konami, its influence on the modern gaming industry has made it a self-sustaining pop culture phenomenon all of its own. Famously, the Konami code has been used in the viciously hard shoot-'em-up game Contra to grant the player a game-changing 30 lives. Other uses can be seen in the Castlevania series, Dance Dance Revolution, Metal Gear Solid, all the way to completely off-the-wall choices such as Ratchet & Clank 3. You know how you always wanted to see Captain Quark in a tutu? Well, there you go. So widespread is awareness of the Konami code that it's transcended the boundaries of gaming, making it into movies, TV shows, and even a Fisher-Price controller toy. The next time you watch Wreck-It Ralph, maybe pay closer attention to that door panel King Candy is prodding at. Let me know down in that comment section which famous video game cheat code is your favorite and which you found to be the most useful. As always, I've been Jess from What Culture. Thank you so much for hanging out with me once again. You can come say hi to me on my Twitter where I'm at JessMcDonald, but make sure you stay tuned to us here for plenty more content.